DRAMATIC VIDEO TAKEN FROM A PLANE SHOWS A MASSIVE AMOUNT OF FRESH WATER DUMPING INTO THE OCEAN ON THE TREASURE COAST. ALL NEW AT 6, JOHN ZANIDIS EXPLAINS WHERE THE DISCHARGES ARE COMING FROM AND IF IT'S A CAUSE FOR CONCERN. These are not Lake Okeechobee discharges. Instead, this is all stormwater from heavy rain over the past two months. Experts say it still poses a potential threat to reefs. They were flying high in a stunt plane. Something caught Cam Collins' eye. It was really, really massive. It had to at least have been 10 miles. Fresh water, lots of it, dumping into the ocean at the St. Lucie Inlet. I was amazed to see the plume out there. There was this dark plume of uh, appeared to be river water actually in the ocean. What you're looking at is storm water, heavy rain on the Treasure Coast that's been building up in canals for the past two months. The Army Corps of Engineers had to release the water to prevent flooding. The Florida Oceanographic Society is worried that all of that dirty fresh water is going to damage nearby reefs. It blocks the sunlight, then they don't grow and they can die off pretty quickly. Executive Director Mark Perry says it all depends on how long the discharges continue. Duration of that is important. If it's just a short duration, small storm event, they can recover. But again, if it's a long duration of this uh, water that's over top of these reefs, it's going to start to die off. And we've seen that now for several weeks. The Florida Oceanographic Society plans on sending out divers to inspect the reefs for damage after the water clears up. Reporting on the Treasure Coast, John Zanita, PBF 25 News.